Doctor, does it matter who likes someone first? What are you talking about? There's a boy I like, but my friend told me that I have to let her have him because she liked him first. Oh, that's not true. Really? Then why did she say that? It's likely because she's jealous of you. Just be careful because it might result in pandemonium. Pandemonium? That girl's gotten a lot better. So much so, in fact, that now she's gossiping. She even comes in on days she doesn't have to. It appears she's nearly fully recovered. Which reminds me, the new medicine will be completed soon. Your data has been extremely helpful due to your generic body type and bland health history. You've been a splendid guinea pig. I mean, participant. So thanks again. By the way, how have I been doing? Have I been helpful? For your escapades with the Phantom Thieves, I mean. Come on. You and I both know that you were lying about needing to prepare for the entrance exams. I visited Oyamata in jail. A swing of fortunes like that could have only come at the hands of the Phantom Thieves. And to have it happen when it did, isn't the only logical conclusion to think that it's you? Is that so? Even though you asked all those questions about him? Well, I don't care. The point is that without you, I wouldn't have been able to complete my mission. I would have never finished the new medicine while I was being deceived by Oyamata. And I would have never met any of the townspeople. I bet the Phantom Thieves save people in need, just like doctors do. Huh? So, I'll go out on a limb for you. I'll have even more powerful medicine ready for you. I trust that you'll use them appropriately. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of death, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. I'm not going to give them to you for free, though. So you better make some money in the name of justice. <laughs> now go. Take care.